Hey YouTube, your favorite YouTuber here, Ian Press 48 is here. Welcome back to another diecast video from yours truly. And today I got two new diecasts. Both of them are both of them are Carl Tomorrow's. Both of them are from 2009. And let's just say both of them have the same names. And before I begin, I want to give a big shout out to one of my good friends, Jacob Hunter Reed, for getting me these diecasts. And let's just say one of them is very, very important with an interesting story. So with that being said, let's begin. I know what you're thinking. Ian, are you making a video about a soapbox? For crying out loud. No. It's what's inside the soapbox because this is what came on eBay. When I opened the uh, packaging to protect the diecast. Not gonna lie, smart idea. And I'm not gonna lie, this may be weird as hell, but I can still smell the soap of Irish Spring. I never used Irish Spring my whole life. But that is not what we're gonna talk about. It is what is inside the Irish Spring box. Let me put my finger inside. And what do we have here? Alright, so what we have here are both Jeff Gordon and Jeff Burns 2009 cars. This is Jeff Gordon's 2009 DuPont Chevy Impala from Hendrick Motorsports. And remember I said that one of these diecasts have an interesting story behind, uh, interesting story and why it's important for me? Well, let's just say that I was eight years old. This is like pretty much my second ever NASCAR 164 I've ever gotten. I was like eight and a half. One day I went to Orlando during the 2009 Martinsville Fall Race. I remember going to Orlando visiting like family members and stuff or family friends. I don't remember. Um, and I brought my Jeff Gordon diecast with me. And then after all of that, before we went to like a hotel to go to Universal the next day, I left this diecast at home. And like I saw Jacob posting a picture of like one of the, of his diecast hauls, and one of them was Gordon's like old nine. I told him like what happened, and then he was like, "Oh, I can help you with that." And I just want to give a big shout out to Jacob Hunter Reed, uh, his YouTube. Thank you, Jacob, for these wonderful diecasts. And let's go give a little three sixty here. Yeah, I know they're chipped. I know all I have is a black sh a black marker. So I don't know what else can do. Yep, I you can tell like it's been used uh, before, but surprisingly, not used a bunch of times, or like not as not as used like to the point where it's like a lot of stuff. But yeah, this is Jeff Gordon's 2009 Dupont Chevy Impala. It says I'm very happy that I own this diecast again for the first time in 11 years, to 11 and a half years. And that's interesting. I do have my original magnet somewhere else in my room or somewhere around in my house. I'm not really sure. Uh, it's, I think it's somewhere around the house or my room. I don't know. I'll look for it whenever. But now let's go with the next die cast and the best for last. Well, the last one. This is Jeff Burton's 2009 Caterpillar. Chevy Ampla SS from Richard Childress Racing, and this is very cool. I I am honestly a fan of the winged uh, CLTs on a diecast. I think it looks amazing. It just gives you that nostalgic feeling or something like that. And to be honest, the best part about these diecasts is that they're both glossy. Like you can see how shiny it is, and it's just. It's just amazing. And thankfully, like, this car has a lot of black, so I can just color black marker on the chips where the black stuff is at. So, yeah. All right. So, a little 360 on his 2009 car. So, yes. Two more new 164 NASCAR diecasts added to my collection. Thank you to Jacob Reed for giving me these die casts. They're very awesome. I really appreciate it, bud. I hope you guys enjoy this haul.
And I want to say thank you guys so much for watching this video. Comment, like, and subscribe for more. Follow my social accounts in the link in the description below. And don't forget to turn on my YouTube notifications for more content. Uh, thank you guys so much for supporting E Nation. This is the Impress 48 signing off. And this concludes the Jeff and Jeff Show, the 2009 edition. Goodbye, everybody.